What's going on, all my wonderful people out there in YouTube land? It's your favorite. Shut up and react. Thank you for clicking on another video. You can be anywhere on YouTube. But you're here. You've already clicked the button. So just hit the like button and subscribe. And let's get into this, all right? So lately, I've been into, you know, Young Pharaoh and showing, you know, Young Pharaoh's you know, a situation that he's going through and just bringing awareness to mental health and, you know, being YouTube famous and having your relationship all out there in the, in the, in the open and whatnot. And, and, you know, people, people, YouTube is different, man. And people want YouTube fame to like be seen in the streets. Listen to this. If you are known in the streets from YouTube, that is big. That's that's huge because you're not on mainstream media. You're not on the rap videos or music. You're just on YouTube. So that means that's 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 big. That also be, can become stressful. That can become stressful putting yourself out there. You know what I'm saying? So we just you know we just sharing the content and showing you know the ups and downs and all that. You gotta show everything, man. You know what I'm saying? But right now we gonna swing back around to Kwame, all right? People been all in his pockets, all in his pockets, talking about he don't do this and he don't do that and why he ain't this and why he ain't that and you know. So we gotta swing back around. They try, yo, they shut down all my my Kwame Brown videos, all of them. Yellow, 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 yellow. They ban his self talk, talking about he he can't promote people. How how you can't promote people? Why you can't promote people? Now they saying he got to add promotional ads and stuff in there and charge people. How you going to tell that man what he got to do with his... Ch man, you know what? Let me get into this, man. Let's get into this Kwame Brown, man. The Dulo twist. Hit the like button. Let's hear what's going on with the homie. Things going around on the internet. I don't know why so many people are into my money. <laughs> but apparently a lot of white people, the wrong type of white people, are into my money as well. Because that's what so, they do. They use these, these angry some, angry. Damn, Kwame, we need you. Uh, yo, uh, yo, your cameras be messed up, bro. Messed up. Three women, some. Okay. That's how you know so he. Ain't a, a, that's how you know he in a sticky, sticky sticks. They got three G there. Uh, baby mama, that I approve. She's called the police on me in the middle of the day. I got the police called on me at 12.44 p.m. in Savannah, Georgia. A man that's just getting his son. I mean, getting his daughter. So then my dog was tased, and now my dog has this aggressive nature with her now. Any male that comes around her now, she, she wants to bite everybody. She own him. Oh. Yeah, because cause that's the person that, that she seen did him wrong, did her wrong. So now she on him, and I bet your dog wasn't like that before. Now you can't trust the, you can't trust the dog around people, you know, coming in. You know what I'm saying? Now, but the police ain't gonna do nothing about that, right? Right? Nah. So they just tased the dog. Who tased it, yo? Oh, because a woman can't let go. She wants to call the police. I've so, been there. You ladies out there that say there's no good men that want to be with their children. I want you guys to listen to what the lead attorney said. The, what kind of man you shout out to the lead attorney too shit he got some dope information man i'd be over there he's up and coming yo official official say there's no good men that want to be with their children i want you guys to listen to what the lead attorney said what kind of man you know what kind of man worth the salt on his back that you put up all these barriers you put up all these obstacles and he's still and trying you make it to where you go into this white man court system. One, I went to jail for marijuana, I think in 2018 or 19. That wasn't mine, but of course, uh, I'm the celebrity, so I go to jail for it. Yeah. The charges were dropped after the investigation. And as a man who's in a paternity case, who's just trying to do what the system say, if you a man, you be a part of your kid's life. I've never not paid child support. Facts. Garden and Lighten has nothing to do with child support. So why are people saying what they're saying on the air? See, yeah, so that guardian thing is just a lawyer for for the for the for the uh for the 
for the child. That's it. That's not saying he's not paying child support. Once you get put into this system, it's all hell. It's all hell. I don't see white men, black men, Spanish men, Asian men all get raked over the coals. All get raked over the coals in this in in the child support system. You gotta ask permission. Get permission for this. Gotta prove that. Man, what? Internet. They're trying to get people not to like me. And the one way you pull at black women heartstrings is to call a black man a deadbeat. Now, if they was to show you bank records of what I've done as a man for a child, mm. you guys would drag that woman behind the back of a truck. Mm. Allegedly, Facts. I think I snapped. You guys would drag her behind the back of a truck for the things that she's doing to a man that's always been present. So there is no doubt in my mind, no doubt in my mind, that if Kwame was a deadbeat father, he would have never been on YouTube talking the way he talks. When that man talked, you know he take care of his business. He may ain't, he, he probably ain't, you know, rocking with the baby mamas no more. But that ain't got nothing to do with taking care of your kids. That ain't got nothing to do with taking care of your kids. Child support is for absent fathers, not bitter baby mamas. So if he taking care of his responsibilities like he's supposed to, and you put, you put him on child support just because y'all ain't fucking no more. Or you mad because he got another broad. It happens over and over and over and over again. Now you got to jump through hoops to see your kid. And now she got you by the nuts. You call the police on me in the middle of the day. I'm a black man with a firearm. The police are reacting to this gun that they see every time. They're real jumpy about a black man having a gun every time. So it seems like the new Dulo twist is for a black woman, not a black woman, any woman, that they can use our government. And I don't know how the police gets a response that quick for a man who has a joint custody order. I can show you I have it. And wow. at 1244, you have to go produce your children for a cop. And With joint custody? What? Yo. This is, and you see why. So you weak ass men were on there saying I didn't pay my child support on there doing all this fake ass caping because I would quiet tan some ass up and you weak niggas getting jealous caping for women. And that's sad, bro. Cause some that's what it is too. It's the, it's a lot of these men on there. They're going to ride with that just because they want to get the, the females, uh, the female powerhouse you feel me because females run deep on youtube you know what i'm saying they run deep you know what i'm saying once you got some solid ones by your side you can run through some shit you know what I, mean? I got some solid ones here on this channel but i ain't gonna do no simp and bullshit like that and blame this man and say he's not paying his child support when that ain't got nothing to do with child support nothing to do with it nah i ain't, I ain't on that type of simping time new sure. Some of you dudes were the type of dudes that used to speak up for men, especially you, weak weasel Tammy. But now, because you're such a bitch, you would just go and believe and say anything out your motherfucking mouth. And that's because he's going to use... First of all... That's because he wants to use anything he can against you. It ain't got nothing to do with child support or whatever. It was just something that he could use against you. That's what it was. That's what it was. He's like, oh shit, I got it. I got it. I got it. Until the lead attorney bust that shit down and say, hey... This ain't got nothing to do with it. This ain't got nothing to do with not paying child support. This is something for a lawyer for a child. All you niggas went scrambling. Didn't hear nothing then. Crickets. Shout out to the lead attorney. The garden and lighting costs five grand. They waive any fee for her. We've been going to court for five years. She's not paid one lawyer fee. Everything is about me, how much money I got, where I'm going, how many women I'm fucking, what kind of women are around. If you have a woman around, she needs to produce an ID. 
What? <laughs> Bitch, <laughs> wait a minute. So wait a minute. You think through these kids you gonna control me? What no. the fuck? So I thought So she could be Googling and typing while you while I had the crib looking her up and shit? Like you don't need to be none you don't need to know none of that man business. You don't need to know none of that man business. But I guarantee you if he asked some shit like that about you. Oh, you're crazy. You crazy. You this, you that, you this, you that. You unhinged. Bah, 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 bah. Why you would you ask me something? Yeah. This was over with because I told my attorney, if this is how they're going to play ball, as a man, I picked up my home. I was going to move back to Brunswick. I was told by a judge that if you can show me an address in Glen County, you can have one week on and one week off with your child. Because I documented everything on the internet, in the internet. After Facebook, when I went up to eat lunch with my daughter, and she had it to where my daughter was rushed back to the class, and they had to call all these different people, I said, what the fuck? So I called my attorney. They said that I moved back to Glen County. I got one week on, one week off. And guess what happened when I went to that? I didn't go to it. Oh, by the way, Kwame, they fucking with your views big time. Big time. 5,000 views? 5,000 views? They've been fucking with his views. And look. 403. He been stuck on 403 after they took 3,000 from him from before. He was at 406. They done took 3,000. You mean to tell me he ain't gained none? None. None. None? My, you, you, yo, YouTube, y'all need to stop playing. Y'all need to stop playing. We was on a Zoom call. Zoom call come. She goes, well, your honor, her original attorney wasn't there anymore. But th for this special case, she comes back. She comes back and she says, well, I don't think that he should be around his kids. I said, wait a minute. You petitioned the court to force me to be around. So, so you say. Wow. You petitioned the court to force me to be around my kids. And now, when I want more time with them, yeah. you wow. want to. And when I'm coming to the school to eat lunch with them, first of all, uh, when me and you were a thing and when you wasn't in your feelings about, oh, girl, um, I was able to see my kids. Whatever you them. fucking no. want. <laughs> now that you can't let go. Facts. You got me all with these white folks. And you've been doing weird ass shit that I don't, you are foreign to me, young lady. And I'm not a celebrity. I told you, I don't give a fuck what these niggas say. I walk this man's shit. And you trying to do whatever you want to do to me as a man, and then dangle my kids and make it seem like that? Man, please, I'm not going for that. I'm not going for that. Ain't nobody, At ain't no, no, no real, no real man, man should ever, no real man gonna go for that, period. Period. No laws and rules you gotta abide by. Now, for you deadbeat motherfuckers, for you deadbeat motherfuckers, for you deadbeat motherfuckers, y'all need to be put on child support. Y'all need to have restrictions. Y'all need to show receipts and shit because y'all are deadbeats, not real fathers. The type of money I pay and the type of men that I hear talking about me, it's atrocious. It's atrocious. I'm not, I'm not finna have no cop shoot me because some baby mama, when you say words like kids and they're in danger and then you have a man with gun, you they can come. get that man killed. They come so automatically you ready to rock. use my baby mama, that's why I said I'm walking away. Cause this woman is sick. And you, any one of them women that you call on me, white folks, I got receipts. I gave the number to when this woman called the police on me in the daytime. I'm not with that fuck shit. You're not going to control me like that at all. Point blank period. Black men don't need no motherfucking gardening light. And I've been paying child support. The truck that you drove to the courthouse, sweetie, that is a 213 brand new Denali truck, baby. I paid for that. Fuck you talking about? How you going to call a motherfucker a deadbeat when you driving to these white folks in the truck that I paid for, lady. 
well, <laughs> well, how, 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 how can you? How can you? Are you nuts? Did you think that was going to embarrass a Geechee nigga like me because I refused to pay for a garden in Lighten because you went into those white folks' courtroom when the charges were dropped for the marijuana? You told them white folks that I got a drug house. You got these white folks chasing me around, worried about my finances and in my business because you're alleging that I'm a drug dealer now. So not only are you a weak, fake, punk-ass snitch, you're sitting here trying to make your black baby father a that drug takes care thing. of his kids, that put you through school, girl, who helped pay for your schooling. You're so butt hurt that you want to force me to be a criminal because I went viral on YouTube. And I'm going to leave it off on this because I'm not going to do the whole 18 minutes, but now you see, you see now. Paid for her to go to school. Got her through school. Buys a brand new car at the time, probably 2013 Denali. Even even if it's a 2013 right now, it's still worth probably 20. 2013 is still 21. So it was about seven, eight, nine, eight years old. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's probably worth 20 right now, 2022. But it's still, but still, it's still, it's still. He bought that for her in 13, 14, 15, whatever. Takes care of his kids. Does whatever. Got receipts and all that. Still not good enough. Still not good enough. Now, you got all these content creators using something that they don't know nothing about. Shout out to the lead attorney who had to break it down. He don't owe child support. Y'all just want to use shit. Well, show you how YouTube goes and the world goes, man. Hit the like button and uh, I'm going to be bringing you all type of shit, all right? I'm going to do a reaction from all type of stuff from a non-biased perspective. Uh, try to be from a non-biased perspective. I'm, sometimes I'm a little sway to the left of the right. I'm trying to go down the middle, y'all. I'm trying to go down the middle here, but, you know, I'm just honest with y'all, man. It's your favorite. Shut up and react. Thank you for if that video was clear, I would have did the whole entire thing, but I'm getting a little nauseous and shit. My eyes are going together like this. I can't I can't see. You know what I'm saying? So Kwame, man, get a better camera or get some high speed data or something, because I know that's what it is. It's not the camera, it's the high speed data he and the stick. So you 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 need high speed data to get a better uh whatever the fuck it is. Resolution. When you don't have any, your resolution's all messed up. But that's what it is. We're going to make it happen. Let's get it. I'm out.